Well, hey guys, Juan here, and this video is going to be a really short video, but uh, of a cool place that I visited and stumbled upon recently. Uh, but before we dive into that, let's go ahead and cue the intro video. You can go your own way. Go your own way. So recently I went to a children's ministry conference, and usually whenever I'm in a town that I'm not real familiar with, I will get on this app that I have on my phone called Roadside America, and it kind of tells you what are some of the weird or interesting places to visit that are around your radius. And so I did that and found this like statue or um, like place called Dine with Jesus. And so it caught my eye. Uh, I traveled about 15 minutes to get there. And it's a, uh, it's in a like Catholic graveyard. And it was really neat because it, I mean, it's got a statue of Jesus, of course. Uh, but it's a table set to where you can go and you can like have lunch or, or dinner or whatever you want to pack and have a picnic on this like stone table and all these stone uh, seatings and there's 12 empty seats that kind of represent his disciples uh, that sat there and you can actually just dine with Jesus and it's kind of a neat place it was quiet very quiet uh, area so you could go there to meditate or just to have lunch and kind of uh, have some personal time but it was a neat little stop uh, but here's some of the footage that I took when I um, made this little excursion So there it is, that's the Dine with Jesus uh, statue or display that they created. Um, if you guys are a fan of any kind of statues or if you've ever come across anything that has really piqued your interest and is really memorable, put it down in the comments below. I'd like to maybe Google some of these things and uh, just check them out and uh, interact with you guys. on. Uh, but this is Dine with Jesus and it's in Brighton, Ohio, Brighton, Michigan. Yeah, thanks for hanging out with me, guys. Uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button. I make videos every week. And until the next video, be creative.